All right, guys, welcome back. Game of Thrones Season 5, Episode 5. And honestly, after the ending of last episode, I just need to find out the fates of those two characters. Like, what an insane ending that we will get onto in a second. But before we get into this episode, if you are new to the channel and enjoy what you see, then make sure to go down there, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, because we're nearly at 1,000 subscribers and we're doing something big for the 1,000 subscribers. So it would really mean a lot to me if you go down there and hit that subscribe button. Also down there you'll find my Patreon and if you want to see full length reactions, early reactions and request movies for me to do as well, then click my Patreon, it really helps me and my family out. So without further ado, let's get into Game of Thrones Season 5, Episode 5. Well, guys, last episode, obviously, as I said at the start, last episode ended with Barristan potentially dying and Grey Worm potentially dying. Like, we had the fight between those two and the Sons of the Harpy. So, actually, I have no idea what that outcome is going to be. Hopefully, we find out in this episode. And also, we had Tyrion and Jorah. They are finally getting to Marine, where Daenerys is. Okay, so it looks like Grey Worm is alive. I mean, I don't really care about him, though. I want Barristan to be alive. No. Are you kidding me? Are you actually kidding me? He's dead. And we never even got to see him fight. Are you actually kidding me? I swear, if this guy mentions bloody fighting pits. And he died in an alley. Butchered by cowards who hide behind masks. Yeah, you need to go ham on them all. Release Drogon and burn them all. Round up the leaders of each of Marine's great families and bring them to me. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay, Daenerys. Daenerys is just going to burn them, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Daenerys, I hope you question them first. That's what Barristan would have wanted. Okay, I'm pretty sure she's where her dragons are. Why do I think she's just gonna say Dracarys? Daddy Drivi. Daenerys, not gonna lie, this is a bit far. Like, you can't just let them all get eaten by dragons. <laughs> oh my god! Jesus Christ! Let's hope that guy was guilty. <laughs> so, she's only killed one of them. Targaryen, alone in the world. Yeah. Oh shit, yeah, they're related, aren't they? That's his granddaughter. Do you think maybe he's going to ask why he made him Lord Commander? There's something I want to do, something I have to do but it'll divide oh oh my god he, oh my god oh my god he's actually off to take winterfell he is off back to take winterfell he's gonna save sansa and theon kill the boy and let the man be born yeah go on john go kill everyone just go kill everyone at winterfell right now except sansa and theon hard to leave when you're in chains yeah, John's gonna lead them to Winterfell. I find them lands to settle south of the wall. They won't kneel for you, and neither will I. No one asks you to kneel for them. Oh God, what if he just kills them? <laughs> what if he just kills John right now? Your people need a leader, and they need to get south of the wall before it's too late. Yeah, to be fair, John actually cares about the people. Lord and Lord Commander of the Night's Watch. They need yeah. to hear it from you. Yeah, to be fair, they do need to hear it from him. You come with me. Or I don't go. Ha ha ha! I guess John's going to the free folk. And we slaughtered theirs. I will follow you anywhere. Hey, of course he will. And they killed Pip. Yeah. They killed 50 of our brothers. Yeah, to be fair, he does have a point. Telling the wildlings you want to make peace. You're just doing it to trick them. No, of course he isn't. John's actually a good man. I know this is hard for you. But winter is coming. 
Yes, it is, my friends. The White Walkers are actually coming. I'm guessing at the end of this season, the White Walkers are fully going to come. So, are Pudgick and Brienne going to attack Winterfell? I feel like Jon Snow's going to... No, Stannis is going to come to Winterfell. Oh, shit, yeah! And she's after Stannis! Maybe Pod. Lady Sansa's better off here. Um, 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 no. Better off with the Boltons. Yeah, the people that murdered her family. The Sarks have gone now. Not all of them. Yeah, not all of them. We've still got Sansa. Swore to who? Her mother. <laughs> yeah. Her mother's dead. That doesn't release me from an oath. No, it doesn't. Brienne is going to save Sansa and Arya. Going to marry her. That will involve looking at her from time to time. <laughs> uh, at least he's a funny psychopath. Do you think she's pretty? Of course I do. I'm not blind. Jesus Christ, okay. She's not gonna like this. Maybe she'll kill Ramsay. Maybe Sansa and her will work together and kill Ramsay. You still have friends in the north. If you're ever in trouble, light a candle in the highest window. Oh, okay. Fair enough. Well, that's definitely coming to light then, isn't it? Uh, I made it myself. Jesus Christ, I don't trust Miranda now. <laughs> oh, God. Down there, at the end. Um, no, 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 don't, no, maybe it's Ramsay just waiting with a crossbow or something. Oh, oh is it going to be Ar Arya's direwolf, right? <laughs> Jesus, all these dogs are psychos. Why do they have so many dogs? <laughs> Unless it's Theon. What if it's Theon? Hey, see, I told you. I told you it'd be Theon. Shouldn't be here. I feel like Theon actually is playing the long game. Well, actually, maybe not, because he could have been rescued. You mustn't keep secrets from me, Rick. Get on your knees. No, 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 he's such a psychopath, I hope Sansa's watching. So I'd like to drink to our wedding. May our happiness spread from moat cave. <laughs> Lord Bolton's just like, what the fuck? I punished him for it. He's not ironborn anymore. <laughs> because Reek has something to say to you. Don't you, Reek? Oh, he's going to say I forgive, forgive you? No, how can he say that? Sansa hasn't done anything. Apologise for murdering her two brothers. What? I don't think Theon did that. I'm sorry. Oh, he means Bran and Rickon. Jesus Christ. Yeah, he, d he definitely didn't do that. Yeah, to be fair, from Sansa's point of view, Sansa thinks she's the only Stark, Arya thinks she's the only Stark, and the two boys think they're the only Starks. We're going to have a baby. Yeah, I, I was going to say, Ramsay's reaction to that is not going to be good. Ramsay's going to kill her. From the way she's carrying, Mr. Walken says it looks like a boy. Oh my god, oh my god, Ramsay's going to kill it. Ramsay's going to kill it. You're worried about your position. My position is quite clear. I'm your son. Yeah, well not if he gets another son. Stannis Baratheon has an army at Castle Black. But he won't stay for long. Yeah, he's coming to Winterfell to kill you. He means to take the North. But the North is ours. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna get the fight between Stannis and the Boltons this season. Your father's Randall Tarly. Yes, he is. Defeated my brother at the Battle of Ashford. Oh, God. Jesus Christ. Okay, don't. No, 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 no. I'm told you killed a White Walker. Did you, Grace? Yeah, with Dragon Glass. Seen what? The Army of the Dead. Oh, yeah, he has at the end of season two. Honestly, that was terrifying. It's time. Oh my god, it's time right now. They're off to fight Winterfell right now. Choose a dozen men to stay and guard the Queen and the Princess. No need to come in with us. What? 
Are you ridiculous? You can't take them into battle. Half these watchmen are killers and rapists. I mean, that is a fair point. I won't be leaving my daughter with, you know, people like people at the Night's Watch. At Winterfell, all the kings in the north are buried there. Brand the Builder and King Doran and... First things first. Well, he has to die first, doesn't he? He's not dead yet. I'll scare the child. Silly woman. Can we just kill her? Kill her, please. Let's kill her. Oh, John hasn't even set off yet, then. Hey. If you guys are enjoying this episode, make sure to go down there and hit that subscribe button. We are so close to a thousand subscribers. Why does Melisandre keep looking at him weirdly? It's very strange. Fair enough. I can't wait to see the fight between the Boltons and the Baratheons. Well, Stannis's army. <coughs> Oh, hello. You're awake. Why is he alive and Barristan isn't? No. I fall to the ground. I am afraid. Okay, you're allowed to be afraid, mate. I still don't think that he's had the, like, full training of the Unsullied. So technically, that's probably his first kiss ever, right? Now you have given the Masters what they deserve. If I give everyone what they deserve, I'll have no one left to rule. <laughs> yeah, to be fair. I have seen you lean on their experience when your own was lacking. Yeah, to be fair, she never actually makes decisions on her own. Well, except when she's feeding people to her dragons. Because there was a better choice. One yeah. that only you could see. There, yeah, that is very true. She needs to make up her own decision. Not that one or that one. She needs to make up her own mind. And it's going to involve jo Jorah coming back. It takes courage to admit fear. Yeah, that is very true. About bringing the people of this city together. Okay, I don't really like where this is going. I feel like she's still going to kill them all. And in order to forge a lasting bond with the Marinese people, I will marry the leader of an ancient family. Oh my god, he's going to marry him. Thankfully, a suitor is already on his knees. See, I was gonna say, okay, Jesus, Jesus Christ, okay. Have these two not made it to Marine yet? I just want them to be in front of Daenerys. Actually, I want Tyrion to just explain himself. I'll be fine, nothing broken, I don't think. <laughs> oh, yeah, Jorah knocked him out, didn't he? Long, sullen silences and an occasional punch in the face. <laughs> To be fair, that, that's like Deadpool's comment, is it? Gonna be long, solemn silence or mean comment? We're going to be spending a lot of time together on the way to Marine. We are. Yeah, so you might as well talk and get to know each other. You know what they say? The doom still rules, Valyria. What about the demons and the flames? Okay, I feel like they're not gonna get to Daenerys for a long time. How many centuries before we learn how to build cities like this again? Yeah, to be fair, these landscapes are incredible. I want to know where this is. Then turn their backs upon the end. The hills that split asunder. And the black that ate the skies. There's no way that Joe and Tyrion don't become, like, best friends through this journey. It's like Brienne and Jamie. They hated each other at the start. And now look at them. This is what remains. So why are they here? Well, I know they're going through this to Marine, But I feel like they're going to encounter something. Oh my god, it's Drogon! Hello there! That's Tyrion's first dragon in years, right? Oh Jesus! Jesus, Jesus, Jesus! Jorah, time to fight! Jorah, Jorah, Jorah! Stone men! Where the hell are stone men? <laughs> What do you mean, don't let them touch you? I'm guessing they turn you into a stone man if they touch you. Come on, Jorah, save Tyrion. Come on, come on, come on. Come on! Jesus Christ, what are these creatures? 
Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Tyrion's Tyrion Tyrion! Oh no! One of them's got him! No no no! This is not how Tyrion dies. Tyrion won't die in episode five, surely. Okay, 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 he's alive. Okay, he's alive. But Jorah said if they touch you, you like turn into one of them or something. You're alright. Okay, okay, they're both okay. They're both safe. They both got out of there. You? No, that's suspicious. I feel like one of them did touch Jorah. Of course, I wouldn't have needed saving if you hadn't kidnapped me in the first place. <laughs> Yeah, to be fair, Jova. Try to get some rest, huh? That's the best idea you've had all day. To be fair, these two are actually going to become such good friends, I feel like. And then Joe was obviously going to vouch for Tyrion to Daenerys. Yeah, I was going to say he definitely got touched by them. You could just tell, to be fair, by his facial expressions. Oh god, what a way to end the episode, what a cliffhanger! <laughs> well guys, that is Game of Thrones Season 5, Episode 5 completed, and what a way to end the episode. I still think it is mad how actors, they can act how their character would act, because obviously the actor isn't hiding something, is he? So he has to act like the character is hiding something if you get what i mean like obviously they know that they've got it but they don't want the other characters to know but obviously the actor can't portray that he's got it because the actor doesn't actually have grayscale but that's mad so Jorah Mormont has grayscale so that means he's going to actually he might not die Stannis's daughter didn't die but it took a lot of doctors so Jorah's gonna die at some point <laughs> that's um yeah but I hope he goes out fighting. I hope he saves Tyrion's life and dies for Tyrion, to be fair. Because I feel like they're going to get a connection. They're going to get to Daenerys. Or he's going to die just before they get to Daenerys. And then there's going to be a whole Daenerys and Tyrion storyline. Oh, great. That's going to be fun, isn't it? Um, they saw the dragon. They saw Drogon. Or at least I think it was Drogon. Unless it's some other random dragon. They are a bit far from thingy, though. So Drogon is quite far. But... Okay, that's mad. Uh, what else did we have in the episode? Stannis is marching on Winterfell. Sansa has met Reek or Theon. Jon has met with, gone to meet with the Wildlings to try convince them to come through the wall and go into like the unoccupied farmlands and stuff over the walls so they don't die from White Walkers and also help them fight winterfell and help them fight other battles in the future well guys if you did enjoy this episode make sure to go down there hit that like button hit that subscribe button as i said at the start we're so close to a thousand subscribers so if you're watching this far and haven't hit that subscribe button then seriously what are you doing <laughs> honestly what are you doing so i and if you want to see the full answer reaction to this patreon link will be in the description and i will see you in the next video goodbye